into Rose Opal Knits. This is a December Extra, the Holiday Acquisition Edition. I'm Daphne. And I'm Erica. And I'm her mother-in-law. <laughs> yep. She's my daughter-in-law. <laughs> All right. So, so this is actually Sunday, December 27th. So Christmas has come and gone. Well, not really because we're in the 12 days of Christmas now. <laughs> so this is the Christmas season. But... We celebrated Christmas on the 25th, and um, so we hope you all had a Merry Christmas, and if you don't celebrate Christmas, we hope you're just enjoying this um, December and the holiday season. So today, we're just going to talk about um, our recent um, gifts and acquisitions. No actual knitting, so if you don't like um, watching about you know, acquisitions, then um, we will have a regular episode next Monday. Okay, so, uh, oh, first thing we're gonna announce is that our make-along ended and that we drew uh, a winner on Instagram and a winner in the Facebook group. And uh, I'm, I'm gonna put their names on the screen just so you can see who they are. And um, the winner for Instagram already contacted us and she picked her pattern and it was gifted to her. And, uh, but the winner in the Facebook group hasn't contacted us yet. Or at least the last time we checked, she had not. I haven't so, gotten any notifications. So. Okay. So if that's so. you, if your name just was on the screen, um, please uh, contact us and we will get you your pattern. So thank you to everyone who joined us in our make along. So that's now, a finish it fall make along. Yep. Because she didn't say what no, it was at all. I didn't, but that's what it was. The finish <laughs> it fall make along. Um, so now we'll just go into our um, holiday gifts and acquisitions. I actually have some that were, weren't Christmas that I just got. In the mail? Yeah. Yeah, so that's fine. Do you want to start with that? That's then? what I was going to say. Okay. Like, since those ones aren't gifts. Well, it's kind of a holiday acquisition. One of them is the other one. Is it really? Well, you bought it, it on just, Black Friday. Yeah, it was a Black Friday That's sale. That's a shopping so I holiday. <laughs> I got hair on it. I've been using it. Anyway, so I got my Molly Klein bag. <laughs> the hands are pink. Good. I thought they were going to be white. Uh, it's like no, I, I like them pink. They're I know. Cute. They're really, they're like a pinkish purple, actually. But anyway, so it's Molly Klein. That's the shop name on Etsy. She got a new tag. Did you see that? No, it's I didn't like, even look oh, at it when I'm you showed me. I'm showing it upside down, actually. <laughs> There's her tag. Cute. It used to just be your name, I think. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But now it's got the, like the little leaves on it. But then the inside's real cute. I got stuff in it, so you might see. But they're just little flowers. Mm -hmm. It's really cute. So. Yeah, and that one was stuck in like <laughs> it was postal stuck. service. Oh my goodness. It was supposed to be here on Wonderland the Wonderland for a while. Yeah. Yeah, it said the fifth, and then it got like stuck. And it didn't move for like almost two weeks, I feel like. Mm -hmm. But then the other one I got, I already undid it, but then I put it back in, in mm -hmm. the thing. But it's my Clark and L. Oh. This is like, um, this is the like mystery. Oh yeah, the theme. mystery club, yeah. the December mystery club for Clark. I forgot to say that. Anyway, everyone's the... probably well. No, not with the postal no, service. They might so not. Yeah. Anyway, so it's well, the December yarn club colorway. It's called Heavenly Peace, and I got it on the sparkle base. So it's really pretty. I didn't think it was gonna have the other colors in it. So there's like a yellow there, and then the purple. Mm-hmm. But I, I thought there was going to be blue and everything, but then there's sparkle. It's mm, really pretty. It is really pretty. But yeah, so that's my Clark mm -hmm, and L. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I got <laughs> one thing that wasn't like a Christmas acquisition. It was one that I purchased, although it is Christmas themed. <laughs> so I ordered this. It's from Sweet Chi Yarns, which is Molly Klein. And it is... Let's see, I forget what it's called. Christmas Breakfast. So see, it's Christmas themed. but And it was like a mystery colorway. So you just saw an inspiration picture and you didn't know what the yarn was going to look like. It's really pretty. So I bought this to share with Daphne. So I'm going to get 50 grams and she's going to get 50 grams. Last time I checked, she still had that in her shop. Oh, too. really? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. That's fun. I like yeah. to look in her shop because she has a lot of updates actually. Oh, okay. Like randomly. Uh -huh. And I like to see her stuff. So, I look at her shop a lot. <laughs> so, that was my non-present acquisition. Okay. We'll have that here. All right. So, do you want... You want to talk about... You want to start me? with bags? Okay. 
Okay. Okay, I have two, so I'll show mine first. Okay. Real quick. Well, one of mine first. But anyway, so my mom and my dad got me a little canvas tote bag. It's pretty. It says knitters gonna knit, and it's got a little tassel on it. I think I'm gonna put a blanket in this bag. Oh, my crochet blanket yeah. can go in here. Uh -huh. I like to know what's going in my bag. But anyway, <laughs> so it's cute. It is cute. I like it. Mm -hmm. And it's just got the one snap, so I like to be able to pull my yarn out mm -hmm. really easily. Mm -hmm. So, that's my bag. Mm -hmm. One of my bags. Alright. Do you want to show your other bag? Because mine's got yarn in it, so oh, yeah, I sure. can just go into yarn. Yeah, I took everything out of my bag. Anyway, <laughs> so this is from her. Yeah. Well, me, me and my husband. Yeah. <laughs> I but you know out. her. Okay. Yeah. So anyway, so mm -hmm. it's this bag. It is My Needle Crafts is the website. And mm -hmm. it's just, I think that's canvas, kind of. Mm, yeah. yeah. So it's kind of like, and it's like a bucket bag. It's got the wire frame. Yeah. I call them yep. bucket bags. I don't know what they're actually called. Mm -hmm. I have the tag. And it has a, a pocket in it. Ooh, that's the little tag I came with. Mm -hmm. Not the tag. It says part. shop on Etsy. Yeah. And then yeah. it's My Needle Crafts online, too. If you want to look at it. Uh -huh. but yeah, it's really cute. Mm -hmm. And it's also got this little thing, which I thought was cool. I don't know. What... Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. It was like marketed as a project bag, um, retreat bag. So. It's big. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's and this pocket. really, really well pocket made. right here is massive. Like, oh, is it the whole Yeah. yeah I didn't even it's like check almost it out. a whole entire thing. Mm -hmm. It's huge. So. Uh -huh. it's and I like big bag. pockets. Mm -hmm. That's my bag. I thought she would appreciate the neutral colors. <laughs> and then this bag is from <laughs> Daphne and Holden. And it is from... It's um, Dolphina Collections on Etsy. It's her collection, but it's sold on Native Fibers website. It's pretty. So it's like custom made for her. For Native Fibers. Mm -hmm. So okay. it's only sold on her website, but Dolphine Collection Has is... Has her own... Yes, on okay. Etsy. All right. And then see this pretty embroidery up here? All of her bags have a different embroidery mm -hmm. on them too. Very pretty. And here's the inside fabric. I like that. <laughs> so should I just go into this? Yeah, sure. Okay, and so, and then inside the bag, they also got the yarn. So. Lofty Loops. This is the Bunny Slope colorway. I chose that one. Mm -hmm. And then Holden chose the other one. And then this is a Homespun House. Unicorn Magic, which you got from Lofty Loops. Yeah, it was in her D-stash. So uh -huh. Aren't they pretty? I don't know when they actually had so that in their shop. Pretty. Thank you. <laughs> I love them. <laughs> Alright. Okay, I have little ass positions too. Yeah, because that's yeah. what I stuck in her bag. Yeah, I just took them out so it was easier to show. But anyway, so I have one of these. These are hard to show because of the plastic. And now this, oh, I bought this from a shop on Etsy. And she didn't have a business card or anything in the envelope. But I'll try to remember to put the name on the screen. If I don't remember to put it on the screen, I'll put it in the um, it's description. It's like glaring. <laughs> uh -huh. Anyway, so there's a little hexagon mm -hmm. stitch markers. And there's like a whole little bag. It's just mm -hmm. hard to see because of the glare on them and then the bag. And then these came with it, right? She's a little try me bag. Yes, yes. And She's included a little those. little bag that just says try me. Mm -hmm. It's one of the light bulb stitch, stitch markers. markers. Yeah, mm -hmm. can't get this out. And then these ones are littler. Ooh, don't drop it. I didn't drop it. It's just, <laughs> it's a heart. Part. It's, yeah, it's Was a there two of those? Yeah, parts? there's two of them. One's yeah. gold and one silver. Uh-huh. But yeah, so there's two of those. Those are smaller, too. Mm -hmm. But I've been wanting these ones forever. <laughs> <laughs> and then Mason lost all of my sewing needles. Mm -hmm. So I got new sewing So needles. I picked up some of these when I went to Joanne's and threw them in her bag. They're glare. Yeah. They're just the, they're like the little plastic ones. Those so are my can... favorite. Mm -hmm. So you can, you don't have to have a long piece of um, yarn. It can be short. Plus you can like you can just work weave it, it in mm -hmm. yeah. uh, more than like with an actual needle. Uh-huh. But yeah, so Mason, like, all my needles went in this little green thing that you could get from, like, any craft store. Because, I mean, I think I've seen them at Hobby Lobby, Joanne's, and Michael's. Mm -hmm. Probably a few more when they were here. But it's just a little tiny tube that twists on, and it comes with, like, two needles in the pack. I had that. All of them were in there. Yeah. Mason so lost all of them. I don't, didn't you think he might have thrown them away? I think away? he threw them away. Mm-hmm. But yeah. yeah. So, those are my little ones. 
You have a whole basket. Um, I'm almost done. This is all I no, have. I am too. So okay. I'll show this. I'll show this. So my friend Julie, I've mentioned her several times on the podcast. She um, dropped a Christmas present on the um, porch one day. And in it was, it was a gift bag full of like a whole bunch of like neat, you know, things. And at this, she had knit me, she knit me a cow. Isn't it pretty? I just love it. So... And I love, you know, the colors are great. <laughs> so it's just nice and warm right I on like your that neck. I blue color a lot. I don't know what the yarn is like... or anything, but Look, it's just we basic. We get her on stitch. here eventually. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to have Julie as a guest. <laughs> but we, like, um, squeeze it in. Mm -hmm. So I thought it was so pretty. So that was one of my gifts. <laughs> All right, you want to talk about I only have this left. Okay. That's it. So. And then, well, everything else is from the same person, and this is from yeah, the same person. Yeah, this is all from my okay. brother, too. Mm -hmm. Anyways, so my brother, he likes scissors sometimes. Like, he likes stuff like this. Like, because, I mean, my family doesn't really know knitting and that kind of stuff. But anyway, so he got me a pair of scissors. Mm -hmm. I don't know where from or anything. They are um, fabric scissors, more so. Gotta clean them. There's, like, they came on this thing, and there's, like, a piece of tape right there holding them in. So they're just going to stay in there, though. Yeah, you have to make sure you keep them up. No, they're the not going to go with my actual knitting yeah. at all. But anyway, so <laughs> they look they're like really great, nice. They look like um, nice they fabric. They cut really nice, though, too. Scissors. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So they're really cool, but really dangerous for little kids. Mm -hmm. So, and then he also got me, I'm going to show you all of them. But anyway, so these yarns, they're from Hobby Lobby. They are Yarn B, and it is Yarn ID. This one is Indigo. Um... Hold on, I forgot what they are. It's acrylic and poly made. So, this one's indigo. And then there is seal. And then fawn. I like this color a lot. Even mm -hmm. though it's like not the best color for me, I love this color. And then rose water. So, uh, yeah, they and they're really all pretty. the same. Mm -hmm. and you have plans for it, right? I think I do. I have to double check on the yardage, but I think it's enough yarn to make a city limits because it's supposed to be faded anyways. Mm -hmm. I was thinking about making it with my tweed, my encore tweed that I showed mm -hmm. just the other week. Mm -hmm. But now you're thinking about actually. But now I'm the, like thinking to do mm -hmm. the fade with this yarn and it would, I think I would do it that way. So top to bottom. Mm -hmm. But I like this look, but then I'm like... That way would also be pretty. Mm -hmm. But I think this blue color would be the best color up near your face. By my I face. Agree. And then mm -hmm. the lighter color would be nicer down by my mm -hmm. jeans because that's all I wear is jeans when I go out. So mm -hmm. I think I it's going to go this way. So, But the, like, I played around with these for a little while. I was just sitting there with the box, just uh -huh. taking the yarn out and moving it. But so the only reason I chose this way is because. The indigo and this would bleed in together. Oh, okay. And then the rest of it would just go. Mm -hmm, so. Okay. Yeah. Uh huh. Those That's are my thoughts fun. on this. All right. So my aunt Terry, um, she did kind of the same thing as my friend Julie. Dropped a gift on the front steps, and in it, she, there are two balls of this Queensland collection Karen's colorful cotton blend. So it's very pretty. So two balls of this in the color 32. <laughs> color 32. I'm not sure what I'll do with this, but I'll, I've got time to figure it out. But it is so pretty. Love those colors. What weight is it? I, don't I haven't even, seen this yet. I don't even know. <laughs> and then there were two balls of this. Oh, it's that worst thing. I, I don't know how to say that. I'm not even going to try to, you know, because it could be said several different ways. Um, it's metal tweed. And the color, these are 50 gram balls. Is the, are those 50 gram balls? I didn't see that. Hold on. <laughs> oh, no, this is 100 grams. Oh, okay. Yeah. These are, well, this is made in Italy, it says. And I don't see a colorway. Oh, it's a color... Number <laughs> zero zero seven six zero, but so there's two of those, and what's the makeup of? Oh, this is twenty eight percent alpaca, twenty seven percent poly acryl. 
Oh, acrylic. <laughs> 13% wool, 13% cotton, 10% nylon, and 9% polyester. So I That's know. got a lot of stuff in it. It <laughs> does. I wonder if I can make socks out of this. Tell me what you think. You think I can make socks out of this? Yeah, I can make knitting. Can you look at anything? Mm -hmm. <laughs> the whole yarn. Oh, I'll take it back. And then there were two balls of this. And this is the Barocco, I'm not going to say that either, Light Lux. <laughs> I'll just put there. And it is 50% acrylic, 43% wool, 6% nylon, and 1% other fiber. It looks like it's got Selena in it. Mm -hmm. That's probably what the other fiber is. Um, and the color is a number 8847, but it's really pretty. And I was thinking, um, these are... 100 gram balls, 350 yards. So what's that, like a sport weight? I'd probably shove it down here. Yeah. Okay. And, um, I don't know, but I, I was thinking about, I don't know, that like a cowl to wear That'd with my coat might work for that. But anyway, I have time to figure it out. So, that's it. I thought the thing was full. <laughs> No, I mean, well, there's two balls. Yeah, each one. no, oh, I know there thought... is something else. You're right, right here. This was also in the gift bag from my aunt. So Regia, sock yarn. I like that one a lot. Mountains and fjords, fjord. I don't know, <laughs> like in uh, what's it? frozen. <laughs> and uh, the color is zero seven zero three zero. But it's really pretty. That's how it'll knit up. So. That's it though. That was, that's it. <laughs> oh, I didn't talk about what I was wearing. So this is my Hyla sweater by Rachel Reese. And um, I knit it out of Barocco Ultra DK. And I actually, this one is, I do have a Ravelry page for this one. So all my notes are on Ravelry. Um, and that's it, yep. right? Yep. So, like I said, this is a December extra, and we'll be back next Monday with a regular episode, and that will be our one-year potiversary. <laughs> I didn't know that's what it was called. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know if that's oh. <laughs> technically what it's called. I've, I've heard other people say that. But, um, so I think we should do a little subscriber giveaway. For our what are we going to give away? Well, we'll just give away a pattern, because oh. with the postal oh. well, service and it everything. It might not be that bad. Actually, like I don't know. Well, we'll talk about it. We haven't made it. We haven't decided yet. But because I mean, we have stuff to give away too. Yeah, we do. But I don't know. Plus, it's Willow Tree Yarn. And it's like, okay, you want to go to the post office? Yeah, I'll go to the post office. That's <laughs> fine. We'll discuss it, and we'll let you know in the next episode on Monday <laughs> what the giveaway is going to be. Fighting about who has to go to the post office. You know? I hate going to the post office. I don't mind I really going to the do. post office. <laughs> I'll be. Other than like when people like come up and like want to talk to me about Paisley and tell me that she's a boy, and I'm like, no, <laughs> back up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well we'll figure it out, and um, we'll make a decision. I mean because, um, we'll have other giveaways. We'll have other make-alongs. Twenty yeah, twenty-one is twelve months long. It's a whole year. Yeah. But anyway. <laughs> So thanks for watching, and we hope you you continue to enjoy the holiday season. All right. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Didn't stop. <laughs> <laughs> okay.